The town of Sumas got hit hard with flooding about two weeks ago. Then over the past few days, more rain and as you can see behind me, more flooding. This is what folks here in Sumas heard earlier Monday morning. That's the sound of a flood siren as people here were told to shelter in place. Several creeks and rivers either flow through or nearby this town. Monday, they overflowed their banks and crept onto the streets. That caused widespread road closures throughout Sumas. This came after another atmospheric river event hit the Pacific Northwest over the weekend, bringing between three to six inches of rain to portions of Washington's Olympic Peninsula and the northern interior. After a break Monday, an additional one to one and a half inches of rain are predicted through Tuesday night in the lowlands of Washington's Whatcom and Skagit counties, with two to four inches of rain expected for the North Cascades and portions of the Olympic Peninsula. While there won't be as much rain coming with this next system, the concern is that rivers and creeks are already filled with water and the ground is already saturated. Still, people here say all this hardship has strengthened their community. I feel like a lot of people are closer now. I've, I've gotten closer to people already that I've known for a long time. And just, you know, now I feel like there's definitely a, there's some kind of different bond there now. So, and that's pretty cool. Both the Skagit and Nooksack rivers crested Monday at moderate flood stage. Folks here in Sumas hoping that this latest system will be relatively mild. In Sumas, Washington, Max Gordon, Fox Weather.